SDRC is a government funded program which runs for eight weeks. There's all the allied health services, there's the support services. There is a multidisciplinary team involved in this program for eight weeks. At a time uh, when they really need it. I had really severe back pain. I've got Parkinson's disease and arthritis. I couldn't move, I couldn't get up. I was diagnosed with cordiaquina syndrome. I've got a crushed spinal cord and it's twisted. And I got into depression, of course. I felt so helpless. It's a big change, really big change for the client. This program inspires people to make changes, improving on their physical strength, their balance, their health and well-being. The goals actually generated from the first week of um, discussions with Cindy and the nurses and the dietitians and the physiotherapists. Uniting Care, when they came along, uh, we, they said, what do you want to do? And I said, I want to be able to walk by myself. I wanted to go by myself, to be active, to drive, to, and gardening is my passion. I wanted to be able to walk. I wanted to come over here and have a cup of coffee. We have a very strong functional focus, so helping them uh, with their mobility, uh, reaching, mobilising. Without it, they're just going to continue either where they are, not improving, or even worse, going downhill. I would have been a hermit. When you've been independent all your life, to not be independent anymore is very hard to take. Without this program, they would be a lot more isolated um, and they would, you know, they wouldn't have the choices anymore. I think the choice would be made for them as to what care they receive and where they go, where they can now choose to, to remain in their home because they are independent and they do have the physical strength to maintain with daily activities. Going through the program, I've completely changed my diet. Um, I'm still physically active. I used to take opioids and quite strong ones. I'm free of it now. Through the program, I was able to say, yes, I can do this and yes, I can't do this. But there's no, not much can't. I can practically do everything. I started driving. I go to the social group. I do my all uh, grocery. And uh, I go to club sometimes. Well, it's given me the freedom to move. I can do things that I couldn't do. I couldn't walk up the driveway to the letterbox and back again without puffing. And I, I can walk to the shops now without puffing. Their dedication to helping you through a really a, probably a patchy time for me as well, uh, mentally as well as physically, because I suddenly realised too that this is what my life was going to be like, and I better make the most of it. We do see those changes happening really quickly um, and people are really um, interested and focused when they're, when they're involved in the program. Um, so I, I love being part of it. I feel privileged to be part of the STRC program. For a program like this to actually um, provide that boost of life uh, and re-energised um, sense of living to an individual is, is nothing that I've seen in my career of aged care. So it's, uh, the benefits are, are, are magical from my eyes. It's improved my life enormously. Oh, it's improved it. No end. To me, it was just fantastic. I need someone who can make me walk because that is my priority. I don't want to be bedridden. The people with whom I have dealt, they are beautiful people.